Hey guys, this is Don My Era. Today we're in a holiday house in Gold Coast. We'll be making a scrambled egg to see if you can make the exact same one and the exact same taste. First, you'll be needing some butter. I use the old butter spread, and you'll need as much eggs as you think you'll need to feed your family. So first, you get enough butter. I usually take this much, and you put it into the pan. Then you, you I usually put um. Oh, uh, A. Yeah, I usually put it on to 9 because that's um, going to heat it up the most. Because you don't want to take too long to heat your things up. Then when you have your butter on the stick, you start spreading it. And then you wait till the, um, the butter gets bubbly and then you can add the eggs. And then you start mushing the eggs to get the scrambled eggs. Do you get that, guys? As you can see... As you can see, you have to spread it all around so and wherever the egg goes, there'll be butter. We're just gonna wait for a second to wait for um this to start bubbling. As you can see, it's dissolving. As you can see, this is what you want, this bubbly. Because that um that will make the scrambled eggs taste better. Because this bubbly is what you want right here. So you just need to wait until um everything is bubbling. So while that is bubbling, guys, I hope you like, subscribe, and hit that bell because we'll be making more videos this month. So stay tuned. Sometimes when it's bubbling, it'll dissolve, but that's good because the eggs. I think I'll, I can start cooking them soon. I'll give it about 10 more seconds. Okay. Let's go. Now, when you're done with this, I'll put this on the plate right here. And you get your eggs. I have eight eggs because I have to feed my whole family. So first you crack one hard crack. Then you go... And you put them back here. One hard crack. Oh, if some things um, fall in there, you can get them easily out. Don't worry. Don't be too stressed. At the end, they'll get all the um the parts out. Now I'm going to need to get these things out, get that out, and then this one right in here. As you can see, this one's in it, so you got to get, yeah, I got it, I got it, okay. yeah, yeah, and then the spoon will be easier. Stop escaping me. Let's just leave that there. I'll clean it up after. Oh! 
Then you have to get the sea salt. And you bring it up everywhere. And then um, we, um, you can put pepper in here, or when you want to go on the table, you can put it on your food. We usually prefer putting it on our food off the dish, so we'll just put it there. Now, while this is sizzling and not ready to get scrambled, you go get your bread. Where's our bread? Oh, over right there. So, you open it. And then you put um you put it in the toaster. I'll toaster how much for this holiday toaster. It can probably only take two bread at a time. So oh this is big bread. I have to see. Gotta have to do this. Gotta get start toasting this. Oh my god, is our toaster broken or something? Because I can't get it on. Oh, yeah, it's working. I'm pretty sure it's working. Yeah, yeah, get, can you get it under? Yeah. It should be burning the toast. While that is happening, the bread is getting toasted. This is sizzling. Now, when you think it's the right moment, which is now, you start to bubble it up like this. This is how you, um, you have to crack the eggs because you can't scramble the eggs when it's, um, just a big bowl. And then you start scrambling them like this. You can get messy, but remember, you want them to get scrambled. So you use this technique. You go up and then this way. Up and then this way. As you can see, some of them are starting to get... Um, Scrambled. Gonna keep on scrambling them until they get the scrambled feel. See, so look at this one. This is pretty scrambled. So you gotta keep on scrambling them. On scrambling, and when everything is scrambled, oh, we'll take those breads. Um, when the when the food is ready, and I think my food is ready. Do you think so, cameraman? Yep. So now. Put this one back here, and what's it's in time. Okay, now we have to get the plates. Uh, these ones, so you get the plates. So, uh, today we're gonna be using these big ones. I don't know why it's sizzling, it should be. So you get how many um plates you need to get. And since I don't have any of more plates, because I'm I'll be feeding how many people? I'll be feeding three people. So I'll be taking this. Ooh! Never mind, my mom. Mom, well, well, the camera just found it. There's a plate right here. Don't worry, that's just extra. And now this should be done. We whiffed it up. This is a really dangerous plate. You need an adult supervision sometimes. Can you spread here on it first? First, you have to spread up the plate. And let's get um this. Let's put it onto the plates. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
scoop it. Um, oh, that's enough for that one. Now it's this one. That'll be me. I, I'm not really that hungry. Bring it there and you put the spoon back. And there you have it. Some parts can be burned because sometimes um, you use different of uh, the pan heaters. How many? There's different stovetops. You get this bread and you'll put it on. I think we'll have to post more bread, but because um, this is only three plates, but you can only toast two bread. So, thanks for watching this video. I hope you liked this video because this was a really easy thing to make, and you can make it every single day. So remember to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on that bell because we love you. Bye.